Hey, what's going on, guys? D Rule 17 here, I'm bringing you a Battlefield 4 video for the day, and not just any video. This, my friends, is Dragon's Teeth. For my first video for Dragon's Teeth, we're starting out on what I'm Lump Feeny Garden or something like that, but I'm just gonna call it the Lump Garden or the Lump Garden, which sounds like some kind of a strange disease. Now you guys want to go play on the lump going? <laughs> anyway, get right down to it. See, we starting off with my M98B. Just had to use this sniper rifle. Hadn't used it in a while. And thought I'd start piling up some bodies with it. But, um, in a non-crazy kind of way. Video game. Let's, let's keep focus there, people. Anyway, this map. Limp Garden. I love the vegetation on here. I love the cover. I love the vantage points for snipers. To me, it's a sniper's paradise. I'm used to playing on maps where the verticality gameplay is just outrageous. You can try and get on a, it brings to just no other maps that you try and get to high ground as a sniper because just on flat ground, you are out in the open and you really cannot do much, do as much as you could from the vantage point. If somebody else could be on a vantage point you, you won't even know about and you're in a good sniper position below they can take you out easily because you are below them and you have to aim up making it harder for you and then you're trying to figure out where he is you have to scope in and all that it just doesn't work out and all the maps you skipped for me I've, I've learned that I actually succeed more when I'm at vantage points if that is possible on this map though, these little bridges, these little bumper bridges are really great vantage points for seeing just about anywhere on the map. Not everywhere, but just the areas that you actually need to see to. Every bridge provides that vantage point for a sniper. It's great. As far as regular run and gun combat on here, just trying to defend the positions is fun, it's easy. You have a little bit of places to hide. Some places, since they're not solid wall, you can the enemy can't just shoot through if you just give away your position recklessly. If you have to use your cover effectively and know when and when not to shoot, you can succeed. You will succeed on this map. And being a stealthy sniper, hanging back, that's my big deal. That's the reason why you're not seeing me push up a lot. And just hanging back is because why do I need to push up? I'm a sniper. Why do I need to play aggressively? I need to just hang back and assist my teammates by taking out guys who are in vantage points looking down on them. And this little fishy right here in the pond had to go catch him. And then he then he came over here with a buddy. You know, now this one tried to put up a fight. Well, he was no match for me. Fishing next for D Real 17. Yes, sir. Right back to what I was saying. The goal for me on this map is to provide excellent cover fire for my teammates, help get these guys all disoriented, not knowing where the sniper fire is going. They're constantly moving, not able to stop because I'll, I'll be able to take a shot at them, and more than likely they stand still for a second or longer, be able to take them out and suppress them enough to where my teammates can easily move in on their position and take them out easily. As far I've told you about all so far that I've liked on this map and what I like to do, but as far as disliking, eh, I can't really say much about dislike because it's not that easy to spawn camp. Well, it's never really that easy for me to get spawn camp. There's always a way you can push out of it, but on this map, if you can sneak past somebody into the grass, you're Doing, you're, you're, you're good is gone and you can sneak around in that way it just has to factor in with what your team is going to do to assist you in that and sometimes if you're going to get a really good team I believe they actually could hold you in scoring camp but I still have yet to be held this right here is me experiencing the revolution factor of game but I didn't know what was going on here and I was completely confused and that tried to go, but the bullet was just holding me back like where do you think you're going anyway thanks guys for watching and tune in tomorrow for more dragon's teeth